My name is Ninnis Samuel, Director of Marketing here at Lenovo. If you're like me, you're someone that probably has multiple devices. I have a laptop at home, which I love. It's got a great size screen, great size keyboard. I can watch movies on it and really use it. I also have a smartphone, and it's got great connectivity, 3G and Wi-Fi, and it's got great battery life. We've come up with a device that actually combines the best of both those worlds. It's called the Lenovo Skylight Smartbook. The first thing you notice is it looks nothing like products that are out there today. It's sleek, it has no stickers, no hinges, no screws. It's also really lightweight. It's under two pounds. One of my favorite things about it is how thin it is. If I compare it to my phone, you'll see that it's about the same thickness as my smartphone. Another great thing about it is that it's got a Qualcomm Snapdragon processor, so it's got 3G and Wi-Fi integrated. Like my phone, it's always connected to the web. It's also really easy to use. It's got a great size keyboard, and it has a 10-inch HD screen, which is great for watching movies and surfing the web. Skylight comes with 14 gigs of flash storage, and something unique we created is this integrated USB storage stick. People are losing these all the time, and I love that we have one that integrates right into the device. Probably my favorite thing about Skylight is that it has all-day battery life. 10 hours of battery, so I can leave my power cord at home and just charge it overnight. And finally, one of the coolest things about Skylight is its user interface. The experience is based on live web gadgets. So you can see here I have one for Gmail, YouTube, a Facebook gadget, Twitter, and these are all live and updating to the web. So I know when I get a new Gmail, or I know when someone's poked me on Facebook, or I could be updating my Twitter status all at the same time. And it has a digital movie store and a digital music store. We really think Skylight's gonna change the way people use the web and media on the go. Look for it spring of 2010.